Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to Tai Chi in the Park. We are here again in the open field at Evelyn's Park to continue with our meditative walking practice. Today's practice is going to be focused on opening and clearing the heart. So clear some space and let's go ahead and get started. Getting warmed up, bring your hands together. Rubbing the palms together and opening up the fingers and rubbing in between the fingers. And bring your hands up the outside. We're going to go all the way down to the Dantian, reminding us to breathe deeply and then out on the inside, up the outside. Deep breath in, all the way down to the belly. Exhale, up and out. One more time, inhale. Filling the belly with chi. Exhale. And over to the other side, inhale. And slowly exhale. And bring your hands together, making sure the fingertips are nice and warm. Tapping the fingertips together, getting that blood and chi circulation to the very tips of the extremities. So not just here at the fingers, but also focusing on energy and blood circulation to the toes. And now we're going to take the fingertips and we're going to bring it to the center of the forehead and we're going to go up and back. Clearing out channels. I have a bun in my way, but you can go all the way back over the top of your head and then to the sides. This is very relaxing. Sensation, bringing relaxation to the mind and body. And then coming down a little bit further. Just being really soft and gentle with the scalp massage. Opening up all the many channels that run through the head. And then coming behind the ear like you're tucking your hair behind your ears. bringing your hand to your forehead and going up the forehead bringing chi to the face and then across the forehead this is called wiping the clouds away breathing deeply relax bringing your hands down warming the hands up again and tapping on top of the shoulder feeling the tap and then letting it slide down encouraging chi to flow down the body rather than getting bunched up in the shoulders stagnant release and slide down all right and taking your hands to your chest tapping the chest take a deep deep breath and then down to the belly and then down to the back lower back
and sides of the hips. Preparing our legs for our Tai Chi walking. Going down the outside of the legs. Skipping over the knee joint. And then open the palms, tap on the inside. And back to the belly. And just relax the belly. And feel the chi sinking into the belly. And let's take three deep breaths, inhaling the arms up. Pulling down heavenly energy from the sky, from the sun. And today there's not a cloud in the sky. Perfect clear skies. Helps make for a perfectly clear practice today. And remembering to root down, drawing energy up from the earth. Feeling the feet connected to the earth, to the ground. Balancing heaven and earth. Let's go into our standing meditation practice. So for last week, we were focusing more on grounding and the lower Dantian. Today, we're gonna to focus on the middle Dantian. So we're gonna bring the arms up in front of the heart. And a way to make holding the arms up a little easier is by letting the elbows sink. We think we have to hold the elbows up let them drop. Allow the shoulder to open. The neck to open. And the center of the palms are beaming energy back towards the heart. So from the heart, it circulates out into the arms, to the fingertips. And from the palms, back towards the heart closing this loop, softening the knees, reaching the tailbone down, opening the pelvis up to the sky, finding that alignment through the spine, feel it elongated, lifted up through the crown, head aligned over heart, Heart open and aligned over the hips. Hips aligned over and between the feet. And imagining that the arms are resting on a ball that you're holding. So when we think of resting, we can relax in the posture. The arms don't feel so heavy. They feel supported. And imagine that we are resting our hips on a ball as though we're sitting on a stool. So we feel that support from the earth coming up from below. And we feel that support in that energy coming down from above. 
And now we're going to shift our weight, come into our universal pose stance. So your left heel will be up, sinking down into your right leg. Right leg is slightly bent. Finding the alignment between your heel, your hip, and your shoulder blade. And soften the gaze, relaxing the eyes. Focusing energy towards the heart and lungs. Supporting our circulatory system. And it's the system that brings nourishment to the entire body. As we open up to both heaven and earth, we start to feel buoyant, as though we could hold this position permanently. Finding stillness within stillness. And now stillness within movement as we shift our weight over to the other side very slowly and posting with the right heel lifted. Weight in the left leg. And noticing how when we become silent, we are able to accept whatever is happening around us. The train in the distance, the lawnmower, the music from the neighbor across the street, whatever it is, it's all okay, it's all acceptable. because you're immersed in your own inner stillness and your own inner silence. And you're just allowing it to grow stronger through this practice. Coming back to center. And holding here for just a few breaths. And slowly uh, lower the arms down, relax the arms. And see if you feel the arms, the hands warmed up. And we didn't even have to do it very much to get warmed up. So now we're tapping the heels, releasing the arms. After stillness comes movement. All right, and just take the back of your hands and rub the lower back up along the spine. And as you do, kind of rock back and forth between your heels and your toes, massaging the balls of the feet. And then rocking side to side.
and then rolling on the feet in a circle. And reversing that circle. And the circle is kind of being generated from the feet, not the hips. All right, and shake it out. All right, let's get walking, let's get moving. So starting with our heels together, toes turned out. And we're going to draw the elbows up and out to make that rounded shape. So we don't want the elbows to be straight and the wrist to be overly rounded. Rather, one smooth arc as though your elbows are being lifted up by a string and the hands are kind of just hanging. And then we're going to bring it up in front of the heart. And the elbows are sinking here. Long neck, open shoulders. Take a deep breath in. Exhale. Sink down. Shift your weight. Step forward with the heel. As you shift the weight forward, we inhale. Open the arms. Open the chest. Exhale, post. The hands come back together. And we're keeping that rounded, resilient shape in the arms. So sometimes what happens is we start to bend the elbows and it becomes very, very flowy. Here we're practicing holding that shape. And as you bring it together, it's like you're squeezing the space in between your arms. Inhale. Gentle resistance as you expand the arms out. Exhale. Gentle resistance as you squeeze the arms in. Inhale. Open. Feeling a lightness in the heart. And taking a nice wide step and post. Now retreating step, stepping back. And we're not stepping just straight back. It's a little bit to the diagonal to create a nice wide foundation. Then we open up as we shift the weight back and post. And stepping back at the other diagonal, bring the heel down. The foot is flat and then we shift weight onto it. So we find our footing. We find our stability. And coming back to center, bring the arms down. And relax the shoulders, walk around just a little bit. Roll the shoulders up and back. So sometimes we're not used to holding the arms up in this way for long periods of time. But this is how we build inner strength in the upper body. So let's begin again. Inhale, draw those elbows up and out. Armpits are open. The wrists are open. The back of the wrist is open. Inside wrist is open. Elbows are open. Chi dripping down the fingertips. And then inhale, bring them up. 
sinking the elbows, palms facing the heart. Inhale, exhale, sink, shift your weight. And let's begin again. Tai Chi stepping, heel down, shift the weight over the ankle. Front knee is bent into a bow stance and together. So what happens when life gets overwhelming, complicated, a little bit too much? You go back to basics. Go back to something simple that you can master. Regain confidence. I know how to walk. I can walk forward. And then we just add breath and mindfulness to it. And make it a meditation. And now retreating step. Shifting back as you open. Post as you close. Feel a relaxation in the joints. Staying low and steady. Trying not to shift up and down in your stance. So when we post, the knees stay bent and you just draw the foot in because you're about to put it back down. Sinking the breath with the movements. Inhale, shift back and open. Exhaling to close. One more step back. All right, and bring the arms down and roll the shoulders. So up and back, and now let's open the shoulders, roll back and forward. Opening up the chest. opening up the upper back as well. So sometimes when we are holding our arms up for long periods of time, our muscles become stabilizers. They get used to holding. So we wanna make sure that we stay both strong and flexible throughout our practice. All right, now let's practice again one more time. Heels together, toes turned out. Inhale into the arms. Exhale, sink, bringing the arms up. Shift the weight, set forward, inhale. And exhale, bring it together. Clearing space, both internally and externally, so that we can see clearly. Have a clear, open perspective. Calming the heart. And retreating back.
and uh, focusing on the arm moving together as a unit rather than multiple parts working independently feeling this unity within the body and relax bringing the arms down and let's shake it out all right so coming in and twisting twisting the waist letting the arms hang low tapping the hips and lower back tapping on top of the shoulder again either the front of the shoulder or on top and relaxing the arms down and let's end our practice with three deep breaths pulling down the heavens filling us with assurance that inner faith opening up to divine faith awakening our own innate power and now again drawing up from the earth filling us with protection a sense of security safety so that we can function at our best and be our loving true selves let's bring our hands to the heart in gratitude for the heart that continuously beats Feeling gratitude in the heart and for the heart. Gratitude for this life. And let's close out our practice with our salute, bringing feet together. Inhale. Hands together. And coming together of heaven and earth to create peace and harmony thank you so much to all of you practicing here with us at the park and for those of you who are practicing with us at home thank you so much please follow us here on this channel 
uh, on our Facebook channel as well as our YouTube channel for more uh, Tai Chi in the Park. Until next time, stay safe, take care, Dao on. Wishing you peace on your path.